Fisheries officers throughout the country were in the capital this week to participate in a special orientation and workshop organized by the Department of Marine Resources. The four-day conclave was designed to update veteran officers of new approaches in managing marine resources and introduce new officers to what is expected by the department and the public it serves. Acting Director of Marine Resources Edison Delavo says the timing of the workshop is critical as the department looks toward the future. It's basically to educate them into fisheries management. Again, it's more than just going out there catching fish. Again, we have a, as a motto in sustainable development of the sector, so it's sustainable mm -hmm. development of fisheries for the benefit of the Bahamian people. And the sole purpose, like I said, is basically to ensure that they have the knowledge mm -hmm. so that they can better serve their various islands in terms of fisheries development and the like. And with the recent arrest and conviction of persons for illegal poaching and harvesting of endangered species, Acting Director Delavo says the workshop will arm officers with the knowledge they need to protect our marine resources. Sustainable fisheries is the thing. We're talking about food security. And if fisheries is to may play, continue to play a, meaning, a meaningful um, part in, in terms of the national picture when it comes to food security, then we must have sustainable fisheries. And that calls upon these officers when properly trained to do what the Fisheries Act and the Fisheries Regulations call for them to do. Again, they do have arresting powers. They do have detention powers. So that means is that if you are in violation of any law, they have the power to arrest you.